Is it illegal to vlog and drive? I don't know. Can you say happy dad dad day? Going upstairs. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, rise and shine. It's highlighter. Bless you. Bless you. Hello. You need Wawa? No, we don't need it on. You got crazy hair. Hello, friends. Is this gonna be the intro? Are we gonna be doing a car intro? You can't even see half my head. Let me try this. That ain't gonna hold you. How do people do this? Do they do it here? It's gonna look like I am naked. You guys, I've never really vlogged in the car before. Let's do the old school iPhone in my phone holder for the intro and everything I have to say in the car. Nobody wants to watch this. That is better, I think. I mean, at least you can see me. Okay, so let's intro it up. Hi, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Brielle. And this is episode 20. <laughs> Throw back to sixth grade. Today, we are out and about in the world safely. Got our masks, hand sanitizer. This is going to be Grayson's first time out since March 9th, March 7th. My family and I have been very strict on self-quarantine. Recently, Minnesota started to open up. But is it safe? Mm, I don't think so. Like, the only times I go out, I go out once every two weeks, and that's to go to Target. And, like, if your girl does not get her Target fix in, I will go Looney Tunes. Fridays are my busy, like, get my vlog finished, thumbnail finished, upload, all that kind of stuff. Because if you're new here, Fridays are my upload days. This is such a dumb statement that I'm about to make, but I'm gonna say it anyways. The more you do something, the easier it gets and like the more you get used to it because I used to spend my entire day Friday like finishing things up and like being so nitpicky. I edit all my videos on Premiere Pro and I was still figuring out Premiere Pro and I was still figuring out Photoshop. I'd never used Photoshop before and pretty much teaching myself with the help of my fiance um, how to do all these things. Is it illegal to vlog and drive? No. For this week's video, I got everything done. I got it uploaded and scheduled to post last night. That was amazing, because then I just woke up this morning, had a chill morning, posted on all my social media accounts that the new video is up, etc., etc. Etc., etc., etc. This car is next to me, and I know they're trying to like be like, what the f is she doing? So I'm gonna scrooty scrooty, still going the speed limit, but a little bit faster than they are. We're having a little bit of a rough start, huh, baby? Are you having a rough morning? Oh, you're having a good morning? Okay, you just said I'm good, good, good. So apparently we're having a good morning. In March for my birthday, before all the madness of COVID, Taylor and I went to Miami. So before we left for Miami, I gave him a horrendous makeshift haircut because Grayson has eczema and it's on the back of his neck. So if his hair is as long as it is right now, it breaks out bad. My mom apparently just couldn't stand looking at it. So she texted me and she goes, do you care if I just take him to get his haircut? I was like, sure, go ahead. And it was the cutest haircut ever. So we're going back to that same place today because his eczema is getting really bad again back there. That's been a rough morning. Okay, so let's go get some coffee first. Can I get a 
might just get um, a large iced vanilla latte. Okay, so we got the goods. Pick the spot. Ooh, yeah, that's nice. We're here. One last look at your hair. He spent the last three, four months in quarantine at home, not seeing a single human being. So he comes out into the world and his first interaction is with me in a mask, which he's never seen me in a mask because we I don't bring him out. And somebody else in a mask and them bringing a, like buzzers to his head. So didn't go the best, um, but I don't blame him. So now we got a smoothie. I told him he could get a treat. Hi, do you like your smoothie? Look at that haircut. It's not the most even, but you look very cute, mister. What do you think? Of his haircut? Yeah. It's pretty good, a little patchy. Yeah, I was happy with anything. <laughs> I was happy to get out of there. Fair enough. Taylor just came upstairs and said, babe, I forgot to show you what I got. Now show me. I'll give you all a second to guess what this is from. I have a mug from this TV show as well, AKA Gilmore Girls. So I thought he got this, this for us. Girls? Yes. I thought you got this for us because I love Gilmore Girls. No, I he, got it for the frame. I was gonna throw the picture away. He's like, I thought there was no way in hell you'd want to keep the picture, but I literally teared up when he brought it in and he was so confused. And Why? I just pretended I got it on purpose. <laughs> oh my God, that is so funny. Hi, good morning, how are ya? I didn't record anything after the whole haircut fiasco. His hair is definitely not even, which I don't know what you'd expect with him screaming and crying the way he was. He looks like he got hit by a lawnmower. Yeah, just a little bit. Um, but he's still cute. So the plan for today is we are cleaning the entire house, like every inch of it. I took a bath and I'm just kind of like a wet dog right now, so it's fine. And my bags, oh my gosh. Are you laughing at my eye bags? Cleaning up the entire- ah! What? You wanna talk? Uh oh. Yeah, he says uh oh after he screams because he knows he's not supposed to scream. Yeah, shh, that's right. Ah! Uh oh. Uh oh. Like I quickly mentioned in the last vlog, I've been watching a friend of mine's baby during all this quarantine stuff. Tonight, we are having a game night because obviously whatever they get, we're exposed to through the baby, etc. So they're kind of our only friends we've been hanging out with during all of this. Next weekend, my dad will be staying with us for the weekend and is going to be helping us with some more home renovation things, which I'm very excited about because it's a lot of big stuff that we haven't been able to do with just Taylor alone yet. Because, let's be honest, how much do I actually help with home renovation things? No, I'm more of like the observer. Hey. Oh, I also have to go to Target today, so I'll take you guys along with me for that. Because I need to get extra stuff for Father's Day. If your girl does not get her Target fix in, I will go Looney Tunes. I just get frustrated. It's so frustrating to me. It's not that hard to wear a mask. Literally for your hour errand or whatever it is. I know I'll probably get hate for what I'm saying, but... I'm at Target right now, and I've probably seen five people walk past me. It's also starting to rain, so I gotta go. I've seen probably five people walk past me that are wearing masks. Like, everyone else isn't wearing masks. It's not that hard if doctors and nurses and everyone in the healthcare are having to wear masks for 12-plus hour shifts. You can wear a mask in your one-hour errand. And that is the end of my spiel. It's raining. I gotta go. Grayson can't write, so that's kind of dumb. 
but I put like the A upside down. Hopefully that doesn't mean like any like demonic cults or anything. I'm so not artistic at all. So our friends are gonna be here in like an hour, hour and a half. So I need to put my face on, change my outfit and get ready. If you guys aren't like this minutes before people come over, you're absolutely lying. I am putting mascara on and trying to make myself presentable and Tay is scrubbing the toilet. That's the type of people we are. Look at that feast. Fit for a king. I was talking about you, you lick me up. Oh. No, I don't. I need a haircut. Do you want some pizza? Who wants pizza? Me. Yeah, I'll be back. What's his name? <laughs> What's his yes. name? I'm crazy. <laughs> <laughs> it is 6 a.m. You're so cute with that haircut. Can you say happy dad dad day? For those of you who are new to my channel, I don't cook. I don't cook whatsoever. He has requested breakfast burritos, bacon, potatoes. You can do it. Look at Salt. me, I'm a chef. Easy as, place in the microwave. Microwave for two to three minutes. Oh no, I've been filming this whole time. Oh, here's a little sneak peek of the show the units. Show up. I kind of read the instructions. Not really. I just read two to three minutes. Ooh, that wasn't ready yet, guys. Don't tell Taylor. What happened to this? Um, yeah, don't want to talk about it. It was enough to melt, melt the butter, but it's not doing anything. Okay. Yeah, you usually have to get the pan hot for like two, three minutes first. Yeah, that didn't happen. No, it looks like freaking egg soup up in here. Guys, I'm doing the damn thing. Look at those look fluffy. Okay. Yeah, those look good. good, babe. Woo! Can you say it to the camera? Those look good. Woo! Hey, don't. All right. Tortillas. Tortillas. Ah, ah, ah. Don't break up my cooking show. 30 seconds in the microwave. We are down to the freaking wire. That kid's going upstairs. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just gonna redo it. Oh, potatoes in your burrito? I'm gonna spice it up, baby. Oh my god. Give a girl a freaking warning. You keep hitting me in the head with the microwave. This is my burrito. Box. Daddy. Go help Whoa. Daddy. That's so cool. <laughs> you told me to get you a face mask. I was just following tomato orders. Tomato face mask? No, it's not tomato. It's charcoal. It's literally tomato. It's the brand. Oh. So you can take that to go when you're working your coffee. This this serves you, not me. Yeah, so I already, I don't I already told them that. Anymore. Yeah. Is this for my desk too? Yeah. It's the vibe. Now that is the handiest gift I think I've ever gotten. <gasps> My sandals. They fit. They're but they perfect. Look too big to put a place for all your razor stuff to go. Uh huh. Again, a gift that serves you. But I appreciate it. Cute. For all your new work meetings, because you're a big boss boy. I like it. Good. I like it a lot. Good. Thanks, babe. You're welcome. What? What? This is the cat. Meow. Oh. Meow. Meow. Is it Father's Day or Baby's Day? This is a freaking feast, baby. You just kept ordering stuff. How's yours? Where did your chicken go? Uh -oh. Found it. 
in your lap. Our crepe haul. We've got chicken tenders, french fries, lettuce wraps. These are bomb. Parmesan truffle fries. Takeout doesn't do them justice. And we're kind of like mashed potatoes at this point. Yeah. Your edamame with like the spicy soy sauce. That has a kick. Hey, put our sushi in the freezer. Warm raw fish is not very good. So it is many hours later, 8.30 p.m. Sunday night. We had that whole feast at what, like five o'clock? Yeah, this is second breakfast. Dinner? All of my Lord of the Rings OGs will get that. If you know that reference, comment down below because I highly doubt anyone who watches my videos knows a Lord of the Rings. She's never seen it. No. Isn't that pathetic? Um, isn't that quote where they're like, you shall not pass. Yeah, I've seen it. No, I just know that quote. So we're gonna enjoy our sushi. We are on, I think, the finale of season one of Lost. So that is it. That is the end of my weekend vlog. If you guys enjoyed this video. Our I'm... weekend vlog? <sighs> this is the fourth take, you guys. So that is Love it. You. That. That is it, you guys. That's the end of our weekend vlog. <laughs> if you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up down below. Hit that subscribe button while you're down there. And you guys have a blessed week. And we'll see you guys next week. Bye!